no one's talked to me at all about Randy or or, uh, or Anderson Silva in any any recent talks. Um, I, I know there was one about me fighting him in February. That's definitely not true. I'm not fighting probably till March or April. Um, and I really don't want I mean, the rumor that we're, me and Randy are fighting in June. No one said a word to me, and and I don't want to wait till June to fight. So we'll we'll have to we'll see what happens. We'll have to talk. I'm gonna talk to Dana about that and see what what the plans are. But I, I haven't heard anything about it. I I don't know where it came from or who was talking about it. I mean, it, it, to me at this point, it doesn't make sense. You know, I, I was uh, traveling right away because I had a bunch of PR stuff planned for right after that fight. And uh, you know, it's one of those things. Uh, to me, it was just one of the things that happened. You know, a lot of people were talking to me, well, you're gonna retire now, you know, you, does that mean you're over? I mean, it wasn't like I was out there getting beat up for, for three rounds. And, you know, it's these guys that, you know, they're too old. You know, you see those guys, I, I don't ever wanna be that guy that's too old in the ring where everyone feels sorry for him. You're out there watching him fight and he just can't fight anymore and he's still going out there. I don't think that fight was that fight. I mean, I was winning the fight and I got caught. I mean, that could have happened 15 years ago. I could have been winning a fight and got caught. It, it's not, you know, it's not, it, it wasn't like I went out, like I said, it, it's not a retirement fight. It's not a fight where you go out there, God, I just went out and went against a guy that shouldn't have been beating me up and, and he just beat my ass the whole round or the whole fight and then I lost. I mean, I got caught. I mean, it, I, mean I, I don't want it to happen. I'm working on some stuff to make sure I don't make those mistakes again uh, and working on some different things, but that, that wasn't a fight that's gonna make me decide to quit. I mean, not to, not to hang it up. If I, if I walk out there and I just take a beating and I just can't, I don't, I don't feel like I have it anymore. If I go in the ring and I, or I'm at the gym and I, I can't train with, I can't beat, I can't compete with the guys in the gym or it just I doesn't feel right for me anymore, then I'll decide not to go in the ring again. But at this point, I still think I got a lot to give. So well, I'll be around for another couple years. My, my, my book's uh, still out and it's been been doing well and I'm, I'm thank thank the fans for uh, for for reading it and and and, and, and getting all the good feedback I've got about it. Um, uh, the paperback's coming out. It's got one more uh, one more chapter in it, which is uh, it was a pretty cool chapter. I think uh, talking about you know coming off the two losses and going forward and uh, uh, you know going forward into the the Vanderlei fight. So you know, kind of covers. Uh, covers that for everybody. So it's a kind of extra, it was nice of him to put it in the paperwork to let me put another chapter in.